Hello class, my name is Jesenia Gomez and my presentation is going to be about body image because I believe this is a very important topic and we should all be more educated on it. The definition of body image is the way you see yourself when looking in the mirror and how you picture yourself in your mind. The way you feel about your body can be either positive or negative. It also has to do with how comfortable and uncomfortable you feel in your own skin. Body image affects your mental health a great amount. It can affect your self-esteem. Self-esteem and body image influence each other. If you are content about your physical appearance you and you aren't nitpicking and trying to make yourself perfect like society thinks you should look, your self-esteem will be higher. Having a good self-esteem helps you be more motivated to do everyday things and keeping a healthy mindset and a healthy lifestyle. Also, You'll have a positive attitude when your self-esteem is high. It influences your mood and your happiness. Feeling confident in your own skin reflects your character and others can see that and it will also motivate them to be confident because when you feel good, you do good. It also affects the way you value yourself and your self-worth. When you have a positive body image of yourself, you will value yourself and know your worth so you know not to let others step over you and knowing you deserve the best. You should always respect yourself so that others can respect you. Having a negative body image can make you feel worthless and you won't be able to see your value which allows others to take advantage because you're allowing disrespect doing to you not seeing your own value. Your body image is so important and it really makes decision making tough, like choosing an outfit. Personally, when I'm not feeling too great about myself or if I feel overweight because that's one of the most common negative body image that most people experience, I change my outfit a couple of times, sometimes for hours, and it makes me not want to attend social events, which makes me, which brings me to my next point. Interacting with others can be tough. For example, if you're feeling overweight and uncomfortable in your own skin, talking to others can be difficult and intimidating because you feel that they see all the negative things you see about yourself. And most of the time, they do not see you in that way. Also, choosing a restaurant or what to choose in a menu can be hard when you're not feeling too great about yourself because you feel that, especially if you are at a restaurant with company, you want to eat, you feel like everyone's judging you about the food that you choose to eat. And also, this can lead to eating disorders. Eating disorders would do more damage to your body than good. Comparing yourself to others affects the way you see yourself and value yourself. Do not compare yourself to other people because we're all individuals with different genetics and lifestyle. Negative thinking brings on more problems when you start to focus on negative things. It leads to more negative thinking and can cause depression. Achieving a positive body image starts within yourself. Treat your body with respect. Eat well, balance meals, exercise regularly. Do not compare yourself to others. Think about all the things you love about yourself if you're having negative thoughts. Surround yourself with positive people that motivate you and encourage you. Reading power in books and quotes. If you don't like something about yourself that can be changed, work for it. And if it can't be changed, find the beauty in it and accept it. Know that the most important things about you aren't just your physical, aren't just in your physical appearance. I would like to finish with a quote that says, Love yourself first and everything else falls into line. You really have to love yourself to get anything done in this world. And here are my references. I hope you guys enjoyed my PowerPoint.